Twenty some odd years ago, I wrote an article for a magazine where I paraphrased an adage about boats. No, not the one about buying and selling the boat, but rather the one that says, if you can't make it at home, you should at least be able to take it home. That was an integral part of the design brief in the ETK. And as you can see, I don't live next to the water. Here on Maui, we only have five boat ramps and two marinas with slips, which are rarely available at a premium price. So having a trailer for your boat is very important. We needed to do something creative for the ETK-30. So let me show you what we came up with. A trailer for the ETK-30. Just amazing. It's all aluminum, seven inch I-beams. Portion axles. Very pretty. Now before I show you what's going on with the boat, I want to take a moment here to send out a very special thanks to Brandon Davis at Turnpoint Design for his sponsorship of the boat's new rudder blade and cassette and a pair of sea foils. What do you think of that? Amazing. Thank you very much, Brandon, for all your generosity and making this whole thing happen. So, following the update, here we are. The beams have been fared prior to glassing. This first beam has two layers of carbon on the spar cap. The following two of the deed tubes have been laminated with their first two coats of unidirectional carbon. And aft, that beam back there is waiting for the D2 for lamination. In the update video I mentioned the seats. Thought you'd like to get a look. They're unupholstered, just shells right now, but I think they look pretty cool. They should be awfully comfortable. And the front one will even swivel. How's that? I want to thank you for stopping by and following along with the build of the ETK-30. Hope you enjoyed this video and look forward to seeing you next time. More progress, more fun, more fiberglass. See you then.